And welcome back, folks, to another exciting episode of Fallout 3. Let's talk to Harkness about his true self. I'm a little busy right now. Is there a problem? Yeah, you could say that. You're not who you think you are. What's that supposed to mean? Look, kid, I don't have time for existential debate. And I'm not interested in whatever religion you're peddling. <laughs> if only it were that easy. Nope, you're a robot. Excuse me? Look, kid, you have exactly five seconds to explain what you're trying to do here, or you'll be leaving Rivet City by the way of the nearest porthole. We can try to appeal to him, or we can just point to the evidence we've collected. So let's do that. that that'll be quicker. All right. I'll humor you. But this is impossible. Very I quick. I can't be a robot. I'm a human being. Ha, that was fast. I breathe. I eat. Hell, I cut myself shaving this morning. I was bleeding. Robots don't bleed. Well, we did learn about his syn synthetic flesh and, and skin and even blood, yes, so... Yeah, not surprising. I'm not sure what to say. I'm not sure what to even think about all this. I'll admit, this is pretty convincing evidence. But it doesn't make any sense. How can this be possible? Well, we can kind of insult him here. Or we can just bring him back. Let's do that. My God, I, I remember, I remember it all, from before, Zimmer, the Commonwealth, the Institute, my God, all those runners I brought down, you, you made me remember, why, how, I, never mind, I just, my God, what am I going to do, my life, everything, it's all a lie. Well, at least you know now. When Zimmer's still around, what are you going to do about him? I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to shove him into a very small box and send him north where he belongs. I don't think the security chief should murder anybody. But I'm kind of an outside force, so maybe if I take him down... Hmm. He is a security threat, isn't he? All right. I authorize you to carry out Dr. Zimmer's execution. Don't think this gives you license to run around shooting anyone you want. Just Zimmer. And that bodyguard, if he gets in the way. Here, use my weapon. I've had it forever. It's never let me down. Consider it a token of my appreciation. All right. That's interesting. I mean, he's, he's a security threat to you, Harkness. Not really to the... To Rivet City as a whole, but we'll take that justification, flimsy as it may be. All right, what are you going to do now? I have two sets of memories. One android, one human. Some of these are mine. Some belong to someone else. But I'm choosing to be human. It's my choice. The people on this boat look to me to protect them. So that's what I'm going to do. Hmm, interesting. And what should I call you now? Probably... I, I don't know. Hmm. Well, I'm not really sure. Look, just call me Harkness. That's who I am to the people on this boat who rely on me. It's who I am now. In fact, for everyone's sake, let's just pretend I've always been Harkness. We'll keep the truth a little secret between friends. All right? All right. Sure hope the Commonwealth will not, will not send anybody else after you, but... Yeah. What about the change? Was it worth it in the first place? I don't know. Every time I retrieved one of the runaway androids, they'd fill my head with ideas about self-determination, freedom. At first, I resisted the ideas, but then I started thinking about it. And well, they were right. We're just slaves to them. We deserve lives of our own. So that's what I did. I chose a new life, and gave up my old one. And now you've given me both to remember. Great to hear. Carry on, then. Alright, it's time that we take care of Zimmer. We will actually have to tell Zimmer about Harkness in order to get a reward from him first. But after that, we can execute him. Hello. And yeah. Harkness's secret will be safe. We'll have gotten our reward and everything will be hunky-dory. 
Except for Zimmer, of course, and his bodyguard android. They should still be here. Yeah, there they are. Let's get ready for a fight. Look at that plasma rifle. What a weird thing. But it's a unique one. It's a very powerful one. Talk to Zimmer. The sooner you find my property, the sooner I can get out of this slum. Really, how do you people live like this? I don't live here. I live in Megaton. It's another type of slum. Oh, we can tell him about some of the info we gathered. Okay. What about the tools that... Yeah, the, the tools used for the, for the uh, facial reconstruction. Really? Someone managed to procure those here in the wasteland? Impressive. But who out here could have the skill to use them? Hmm. You're making progress, certainly. But you've got nothing more to learn from me. Get back out there. Sure. Standing around all day chit-chatting isn't going to help you track down my android, is it? No, but I can talk to you about Pinkerton. Yeah, the memory dude. The technician. Excellent news! We're close. So close! Find this Pinkerton. Learn everything they know. I want that damned android, and I want him now! <laughs> right. What? Yeah, what? Before I do the last bit, let, let's talk about the Commonwealth. The Commonwealth itself is nothing but a war-ravaged quagmire of violence and despair. Inside the sealed environment of the Institute, however, but the Institute's affairs are none of your concern. Your undeveloped mind couldn't even begin to comprehend what we've accomplished. You know, these guys are kind of arrogant, kind of like the outcasts we met, we met earlier. I don't like him. Let's talk to him about Harkness so that we can get our reward and then execute him. Harkness, you say? Yes, yes, that makes sense. He used to work for a special branch of the Commonwealth Police, after all. And he's right here, in Rivet City? Excellent! I must wait, find an opportune moment to confront him. Thank you for your discreet assistance and continued discretion regarding this matter. <laughs> Very and discreet. now for your payment. This combat module will directly affect your central nervous system. I think you will find it quite beneficial. Yes! We lose karma, but we gain a special perk that you can only get from this quest. So that's kind of awesome. But now that we got this perk, there's no reason not to take these guys out before they can attack Harkness and try to take him in. Let's go for Zimmer first. Yeah. For a moment there, I thought he wouldn't attack me. Guess I was wrong. And that's when you use a plasma weapon. They turn into goo. Right. An android component. Okay. Well, he was an android. And that right here is Dr. Zimmer. Right. So much for them. People, well, Harkness is safe now, and we finished another quest. And because we had official authorization, security won't stop us in any way. Right. So, that is one quest line down. I think we can also quickly travel to Greyditch to finish another quest line. That should... That should be, you know. That should be doable really fast. Maybe a little psycho. Uh, maybe another time. You remember Brian Works, right? He still needs to get to his aunt slash cousin, whatever. Um, so let's go to Greyditch and tell him about.
his new home in Rivet City. Should still be in. No, wait, he said he would go to his house, didn't he? Yeah. He cleaned the place up a little bit. But he moved the corpses at least. Hey there, Brian. Holy moly. You actually came back like you said you would. Yep. Did you find me a home? Yep, again. I hope you found me a place to live. Yeah, sure did. Vera will take you in. You really found her? Oh, thank you so much. I can't believe everything you've done for me. Most people would have kept on walking when I ran up to them screaming like I did. I'll get my stuff together and move on out there right away. Come visit me sometime. There you go. Now the weird thing is, we don't have to get him there at all. You know how far it is to Rivet City and there's super mutants in the way. But Brian is apparently quite resourceful. He'll make his way there on his own, safely. Alright, I think this is a nice place to stop. We finished two major side quests. And, well, there are plenty more to go. But more importantly, we kind of got our hands on some special perks. Just to show off, this is the ant mite perk we got for, uh, for the whole um, queen, queen ant quest with Doc Glasgow. And now we got Covert Ops. This was, of course, from uh, from the Anchorage DLC. And now we got Wired Reflexes from the quest line about the Replicated Man. So, this should be sufficient for now. Next episode, well, wherever the wind will carry us. We'll see what to do next. See you then, folks. Bye!